Hey folks, Papa Boris here, playing some more Hades. We're using the bow aspect of Chiron, and we're playing on five heat, because four is kind of an awkward number of heat to do, so we'll just bump it up a notch to five. Do we get? Actually, I should start giving more nectar. I have 10 nectar saved up. Let's get working on this epilogue. Do we get? Hangover special? We do. It's the one that's not rarity upgraded, but I'm not complaining. Really need that. Oh, wow. That, that armor sure does take a lot of chewing. You could probably start skipping these fish. I think the, one in, the ones in Hades just give gems. I don't think they give anything else. Could be wrong. There's, you know, the minuscule chance of getting a rare one. Though I'm not actually sure what the rare ones give. Don't know if that's even worth it. Had some pretty good luck with rare fish on this save file. Or Okay, could consider re-rolling this, because health doesn't do anything right now, but I feel comfortable enough that we can grab an early health and just be glad to have the, you know, 64 effective HP later. Ooh, that was, that was quick. Gems! Oh dear, oh dear. It would have been nice to re-roll that into Nectar. Since I still only have the one upgradable boon right now. And increasing hangover by two per arrow is a pretty big deal. No? More? Alright, you big old lug. Hmm, lightning. Okay, I'm gonna go for Poseidon because I don't really care about the attack. And with Poseidon, I have a chance to get a call. Oh, it's the fountain room. Oh, forgot to give him nectar. Oops. Cast, dash, and then this one. I guess we'll take the dash. It is a good time to push things away. Uh, here we will grab the palm. I'm still guaranteed to upgrade my special. Whoa, hold on. Okay, so we were playing with two levels of benefits package, so armored enemies have two perks each. These look like they're on the speedy side compared to what I'm used to. Yikos. Oh, and they also have the Red Rover chains between them. Good enough to eat. Okay, there's the biggest upgrade. Ooh, hang on. I doubt I'm gonna get spend any money here. Oh, the 25, nah, it's, it's fine. If I was swimming in money, perhaps. Okay, so let's pump it up. You could consider using um, the Chthonic Companion here. But I just don't think that's a super hard mini boss, And I think my uh, gambit paid off. Ah, man. Okay, so we've got, I think the damage resistance is what I'll take here. 40% or health or below, 50% damage resistance, that's fine. I don't mind the reroll since we use two kind of frivolously to reroll gems early in the run. Do I actually even need to prep those witches? Those witches really melted. Oh yeah. I think I think they just have so low health that even just like the basic damage of the bow is enough to to murder like oh my god, I just dashed into it and it died. Okay, we got a Chaos Gate, and that's worth it. I'm not giving anything up, just a key or a shop. Probably gonna have the curse in our fight against Meg. We've got no attacking, no casting, 
And no specialing. Oh, well, how special. So we're obviously not doing the no specialing. Uh, hmm. I think I'm going to take the coins. I just don't value attack on the bow. I think for most weapons, I would be taking this one. I could just not cast for a little while, which is no big deal, and then have a pumped up attack damage. But here, we get bonus coins, and it's... Mm, wait a minute. I'm an idiot. Uh, I need to attack. <laughs> God. Oh, Lord. Okay, the correct decision there was to take the one that damages me on the cast. I was just thinking, oh, I don't value the attack. Yes, but I still do the attack with this particular weapon. I attack first, and then I pump it full of hangover. So it's going to be a little awkward now. We're going to have to just um, raw special. Although, here, maybe we can just Poseidon dash. Ah! Letting, letting the dash do the heavy lifting. I was I was just noticing I was just getting hit by these armored skulls, which seem to have fury speed buff. Okay. Are we going to roll the special? We're not. We rolled a Poseidon dash. Okay. That's fine. I mean, it does do more damage. What... Oh, I should, I should look up some other time, perhaps. Not when I'm about to get charged by old Fatty Six Slice over here. Okay, I guess this is, it's okay. These these guys don't have armor, so I can actually just stun lock them with my special. Whoop! <laughs> that was funny. Dashing through. Ships passing in the night. Okay, what do we got here? Well, we have a new one, and this one's great. It's fantastic for this weapon aspect because a lot of the same specials are going to hit each other. That's actually a really huge damage increase. Once I can start using it, that is. Okay, can I? No. Okay, yep, still not able to talk to my friend the boulder here. Can't skip the shop. One thing that's worth noting is if I had gone to the mini boss room, I'm actually gonna buy Zeus just to five five percent damage bonus. Cast vengeance. Yeah, we'll take the revenge. I always like the revenges. Um, if I ha there was a reason to not go to Sisyphus there, and that was to have another encounter so I could actually use my attack on this combat. Now I would take five damage each time I attack. What I'm going to do is attack anyway. We're just going to do this to um, pump her full of hangover. We'll, oopsies. We'll just do it a few times. My, oh, hold on. Uh, nope, nope, nope. I don't know why I kept doing it even after it was very clear that indeed I was not firing shots fast enough to uh, not get hit. Oh, God. Okay. All right. Well, now I don't know if I should attack anymore. Oh, right. I can't use my companion. I'm using Meg. One run with Thanatos. Trinket. Thonic companion, I should say. that Because trinket is actually a keyword. Was enough for me. Oopsies. All right. Does she have another vulnerability? There's the last one. Oh god, why was I only dashing? Oh no, stop. Okay, mm-hmm, yeah, okay. Right, this is very slow, very painful, <laughs> but slow and steady in addition to being a roaring dumpster fire, won that race. Glad this boss doesn't have any more health. Whew, okay. Okay, okay. So we gotta get this trinket off of me, and we'll take we'll take the palm blossom. So let's roll the new lifestyle. Normally I would take um, the coin purse here for the 150 coins, but you know, let's just say that getting an extra level up on a random skill is worth 150 coins.
Okay, Poseidon, I still would like to get a god power. We have a special and a dash. Could still be rolling attack and cast. Oh, hang on. I don't have the... Well, okay. I don't have the curse anymore that prevents me from attacking, but the way that those guys fanned out and there were so many all in a clump kind of made it tempting to just shoot the special raw. Notice that just melted the health way before the hangover could even go into effect. That's because of the hammer upgrade that it deals... I forgot to give him the nectar again. That it gives... Um, deals more damage for each consecutive hit to a foe. And this weapon aspect is all about that because all the arrows hit the last foe that you've attacked. Passing on health there to get Hermes, I think it's important to do that. Now you could say, well, uh, game mechanics. If you don't take Hermes now, you're more likely to get it later because the game often forces you to get two of the Hermeses. But I'll just take it now. I would like my special to be faster. God gauge to fill up automatically, of course. Those are the two big ones I can think of. Oh, forgot to give him a nectar as well. Drop faster, move faster, attack faster. Yikes. Well, we'll take move faster, I guess, but that was a major whiff. Okay, um, hmm. I could reroll this twice to guarantee a nectar for an upgrade, but I think at this point. Oh, what? There's a trove here. Gems. We'll just take the darkness. It's double darkness because it's a mini boss. It looks like this is just... Okay, this is ta Oh. But why is this tagged as a mini-boss room? Mike, wait, am I just crazy? Was it was it the gems? This is this is it. This isn't, is it? Oh my god. No, the, the, the gem room was a mini-boss room. This is just a normal room. It can be a little tricky to tell sometimes. Oh god. I did not notice the skulls charging at me and everything. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, wait. that No, that's doubled. That is... I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why that was a mini-boss room. Um, here... I'll take Ares because he's new. Arguably, the better choice was to take Poseidon and try to get the boon that makes your god... Your Poseidon god power last longer and suck enemies in. But uh, we'll take the 5% damage buff here. I would not mind his revenge. Um... The one that makes all your stuff do more damage by a little bit. Or actually, uh, his attack. You know, setting up the bow aspect with a single attack and having that attack do doom is pretty nice, especially if the doom is rarity upgraded. Okay, we're going to wait for the god power um, when the next batch of enemies spawn and try to get, you know, more than one. Oop. Okay, do it again. Oh, missed that one somehow. The Poseidon Dash is very strong as you can push things into walls for extra damage. And I just got Persephone to buff my God Power, which is really good. That increases the damage by like 100, I think. Yeah. Yep, from 250 to 350. Pretty significant deal from your trinket. Yeah, yeah, I've been sleeping on that. Okay, well, we got both the ones I was hoping for, the attack and cast, and special do more damage, or the doom. We'll take the doom. Just pop an extra 75 damage on an enemy each time I'm setting up for the special. Okay, what am I doing? Just what? So we've actually got a very good setup here because we have the doom, and then we have each consecutive arrow from the special does more damage. So, it's actually a pretty strong thing we've got going on here. Oh my god. <laughs> that was terrific. That was terrific gameplay. Absolutely extraordinary. Okay, that was a quick cut. We got mini boss keys, regular darkness. Okay, we'll take regular darkness for both the long term darkness relevance and the short term. Healing and bonus HP relevance. Let's see who's 
Okay, so this, I think I actually feel all right here, even if I do get like the armored ones, I didn't. The armored poison throwers can be kind of scary, but um, actually, I don't know. I think I think if these guys were armored, I would be in trouble. Well, okay, not in trouble, like as in <laughs> dying on the stage, but uh, oh, come on. Oh, <laughs> oh man, I was like, oh, let me just use my god power to steal that kill from Than, and then I proceed to run into a brick and just sit there. Okay, come on. Oh, what? I'm crushing him. Oh, I wasn't. I was looking at the numbers. I was just panicking because it was like three to two for a second there. And now, now we're fine. Let's just not get hit by whatever that is. Perfect. Twelve darkness and some twenty-five health. Perfect. Hermes. Remember the nectar. In the name of Hades. Dash to recover health, cast it. Wow, wow, just uh, just a big old wow. I guess we'll take the extra dash because I have Poseidon. So one more dash is fine. A shame that was not the rarity upgraded one. But guess it'll have to do. You know what just occurred to me? I could easily get four heat by just doing two levels of extreme measures and one of uh time deadline or timed deadline timed deadline tight deadline why did i not think of that for the last two runs that was unusual of me well actually is it though is it is it unusual of me to miss the obvious maybe not as unusual as what i would like it to be in my fantasies Okay, got the doom, got the hangover, got the extra damage. Pretty good, pretty good speed on this. You know, I could have just had a uh, timed, timed, tight deadline doing literally nothing, literally nothing to make the game harder. Cause I would definitely clear the game within, you know, 36 minutes. But instead I have two levels of benefits package. Oh no, it's not two, it's one, it's one. Right, 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 two would be five feet all by itself. Okay. So not the end of the world, I guess. But yes, I could have not had every single armored enemy in the entire game. Will it kill it? It will. I could have not had every single armored enemy in the game having some sort of a perk in exchange for nothing. Literally nothing. Well, uh, yeah, we'll keep her on. Keep her on. Mmm, okay, we'll take that. Just gotta remember to actually go into it. But it should be pretty easy once you're comfortable with the maps. Basically, Chaos Gates can't spawn during the boss, or like in the boss chamber, or the chamber right before the boss chamber, I believe. But they will spawn in like the first room when you start an act. Okay, I'm not gonna ignore it. Okay, no specialing, no collecting casts. All right, uh, I don't dash strike with the bow, so we're gonna take this one. Even though it is relevant, I might, you know, die where I wouldn't have otherwise. But I believe that when you get it back after the curse lifts, your health rises with it. I should actually pay attention to that, I'm not sure. But I can deal with that, and the special doing an extra 50% damage is relevant because, you know, we do hit the enemies with a whole bunch of special arrows. So we'll see how that goes for me. And we'll grab some darkness. Okay, one moment. I'm gonna do a quick cut. Okay, we're back. So we're starting off with some bozos. Okay, <laughs> get it, bozo? Because they, they shoot a bows. Okay, uh, more of those. Yeah, man, that da wait, does that do 70 damage? Or, or is that damage number that I saw including the smack into the wall?
Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Yep. What? Oh my God! I'm missing something. You. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. Drunken flourish. I believe that's my special. Yep. Cool. Up to eight. Yep. Great. Hmm. Healings. An extra one. Okay, well, I haven't used one yet, so we'll just leave that be. I guess we'll go here. You could have made an argument for skipping this here. Simply because I don't know what I really need. I don't need attack damage, and I don't need death defiance. I guess we'll take the healing. And we'll take the mini boss. I'm hoping to get the fists. All right, are you going to give me the fists? Uh oh. Oh my god, you know what it is? You know what that is? You know what that is? That is the dialogue for having Extreme Measures 3 and then turning it off. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, what the. 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 Seriously, guy? Seriously? As serious, more like as. Are you serious? Um, we'll use the companion right here. It's a little tricky because I did it too soon and wasted it. I really thought that that invulnerability... You want to charge me? Oh, okay. Well, I guess you can. Oh my god. <laughs> Wasting summons. Like, it's... I didn't, even, I didn't even need the summon. I mean, I got him fast enough anyways. Also, I had a bunch of charges on my god gauge, which I would have had the full gauge if I hadn't used one frivolously just to piss me off when he was charging. Okay. Well. Oh, hey, we haven't seen this one yet. Well, that's actually terrific. This really makes a huge difference. You can, can definitely see the increased rate of health melting with this. I mean, I, I believe it's still, oh god. Oh, jeez. Okay, so these are the ones that leave behind the, the the three exploding heads in addition to the actual re one that recharges. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Okay. You know what? I'm glad I saw Patrickless with that healing that he's given me. Uh, you know, it's turning out to be not irrelevant. Let's just sign in here. Um, did I get the real head? Oh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay, 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 okay. Gotta take a moment and see which one's not red. Pop, pop, and we're done? Yeah. Okay. We'll do the one that's new, because nothing was really relevant at that point. And... Ah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm healing from Patroclus. Am I gonna take a palm? No, I'll re-roll this. Trying to get some more health, and that's exactly what happened. I don't know if health is like slightly more likely than palms, or sorry, than uh, than boons. I feel anecdotally uh, as though whenever I have that situation, which is sort of common, two rooms, one of which is coins, one of which is palm. I feel like that happens a lot. Could be wrong. Could be confirmation bias. And then when I re-roll one of them, it seems to get re-rolled into health more often than into boons. I could, of course, however, be incorrect. Not done. All right, we'll just, we'll just hit one guy one time with my god power like a grandmaster champion of the game. Oh, what, there's someone died dead back there? Okay, now we'll try to get two enemies. Oh, look at that, we got two enemies. Yep, 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 yep. I'm gonna be inducted into the Pro Gamer League with that one. Um, a Palm or Dionysus? We'll take Dionysus. I could still get Strong Drink, which is relevant for two more fountains. You know, it's just, it's just like comfort food. I just like knowing that I will heal to full after the boss fight, or after the tunnels, as the case may be. Okay, Bo and the Poseidon Dash are very good at dealing with those pinwheels. Why am I doing it this way? Why am I doing it this way? Poseidon? Oh, more of these? Oh, God. 
All right. Yeah, got me, Thomas. And Poseidon. Ooh, got them both. Feels good. Feels like I can do anything. You know, people tell you you can do anything you set your mind to, and then you get older and you stop believing it because it's not true. Well, I just believed it again when I hit two enemies with Poseidon. All right, we got the revenge boon. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm never going to get the achievement for all the duo boons. Also, it's not even that big of a deal, but I'm going to take it anyways. And we're going to pass on strong drink, which is heartrending. Okay, shop it is. Yeah, we'll take a random boon. Poseidon, great. Can you can you give me the rupture? Pull, pull foes in? No, 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 no. All right, so uh, hmm, I could take the cast just to make the casts less likely to show up. This would make my god do more damage to bosses. Fine, we'll take that. We'll leave the cast out in the open. Can I give you nectar? I can. You enjoy that. Oh, hold on. There is a money urn there. Okay, we're gonna save the companion for when Theseus stands still before calling a god to assist him. Ah! No, that's not what I wanted to do. Auto aim. Oh wow, he's already at half health. Well, it, I do have the thing with the doom, the hammer, that makes stacking specials do increasing amounts of damage and hangover damage being dealt faster. Oh, I have a greater call. Okay, well, I guess I will do the greater call. Oh, he actually blo he blocked it. Oh my god. Was All right, you know what? It was as good as it needed to be. Just make sure I don't press the button too soon. Okay. This should be pretty easy, because he's dead. He's just dead. Okay, that's why. I was trying to come up with a clever reason of like, well, it should be easy because it's Artemis, and Artemis is not a very, but it was easy because he was dead. And we're moving on. Don't have strong drink, but I heal to full on that one. And here, I think we'll take an opportunity to level something up, because it's just feeling like a very strong run. I think we'll finally finish off this distant memory. Darkness? I don't think I need next boon as upgraded. Actually, okay, hold on. I'm curious, if I take the upgraded rarity, does that mean it's guaranteed to be legendary? Because we already have a minimum level of epic. Could have done that for science, but I don't really care that much. And... Um, or not, not legendary, sorry, heroic. Legendary is a different class of boons. Heroic is the top tier of rarity but i don't actually care that much about the difference between epic and heroic even if that were true and i'm gonna gamble that if anyone cares for just pure scientific reasons that uh the information is available on reddit somewhere okay what do we got palm or aries well let's grab aries i actually wouldn't mind um doom effects take longer to activate and do more damage because i really only ever put a doom on the one time so it's pretty much a free upgrade hello satyr nothing is better than golf with the satyr and is that it yep i could of course consider re-rolling aries to try to get like poseidon on here because i still am missing that i don't think i, I think i still think i haven't seen it I think I still have not seen the rupture thing. I'll have to check the prophecy list just in case. Maybe I forgot. The thing that makes your god, your Poseidon god power last longer. It's like a lot too. It's like a whole second longer. Which makes even... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Use the god. Okay, that just took off the entire armor. Nice. Oh, yeah. Thonic Companion, worth it just for that. Woof. Cast, Doom, Doom. All right, well, 
this is fine if you have Doom on your special, which is a weird bow build you can try to do. But we'll just take that one. Could have taken the cast just to get the cast out of the way. And now we'll take health. I think next would be Zeus. I, I don't think I value the palm very much. Even a double palm. Oh, I don't think I hit the right enemy. Yeah, hold on. Okay. Oh, hitting it with the attack actually stuns it to stop it from beaming. Huh, interesting. I guess that makes sense. I guess enemies without armor do typically get... You know what? We have... Some... Some frisky business here with the Chthonic Companion. But the way I see it is I just need the one for the mini boss if there is one and I, I can't use it against Hades he still hasn't given me the go ahead to use the Chthonic companions in the fight with him okay I'm just gonna kill that satyr because satyrs are annoying oh she actually went up that line so maybe she got something else up there satyr this is my least favorite room so first Ah, poison floor. Okay. Is that a rat digging out of the ground? Ah. Ar multiple armored rats. Oh no, didn't hit it twice. I was hoping to hit it twice. Oh god, wow, what a what a wombo combo we got here. We got the beamazoids making it uncomfortable for me to just hang out with the rats and kill the rats. But at the same time, there's the rats. And then there was a satyr. It's just a whole lot. Yeah, it was a lot. Okay, let's get back out of here. Come back. Hmm. Quick one. Oh, cut up. Three rats. All right. Where did I use all my Chthonic companions? Oh, I wasted one against the Minotaur mini boss. Oh my god, we're really backed in there. I used one against the solo rat. I used one in that tunnel at the beginning. Right, at the, the, the end, I should say. The exact opposite of the word I actually said, yep. Where's the other one? I've used four. Doom, dash. Could sell that, try to get the flex. Titan blood in the outside shop. Right, we're just gonna we're just gonna Poseidon dash on these rats. Seventy, yeah, it's it's seventy damage at level two. Though is that rarity upgraded? No, it's just basic. Oh no, it's fifty six. I don't know why. Oh, uh, hmm. I don't know why it's seventy. I don't know if I have anything that. Yeah, I don't think I have anything that would make that do more. Okay, I'm not gonna sit here trying to figure it out. Don't actually care enough, but. Let's see healing cast move speed well we'll take it because it's cheap we'll take the healing because it's cheap and that's useful in case this isn't the fountain tunnel okay I'm gonna go to the opposite end I was hoping to get farther away from the rats but I Poseidon dashed them ahead of me oh no that didn't didn't kill off the rats Cast, Jolted, God Gauge. We'll take God Gauge. So there's the Poseidon one that just does it faster when you take damage. This one is nice, it's a smaller percentage, but it's take or deal damage. Oh, hold on. Uh, that's, that's not a Titan, but that's a Diamond, so I wouldn't have wanted to flex here anyways. Let's take a Palm. Dash, Doom, ugh. Well, I guess we'll double our Doom damage. Uh, we'll take the Poseidon searching for that rupture one that may or may not actually still be. I mean, I, even if I have not, even if I've already taken it before for the achievement, I still just want it. It's a, it's a really good boon, but alas. Um, do I take this just to make my god power add some rupture to the boss? I don't think so. We'll just take the cast. 
And I can either take plus one level or an, a rarity upgraded Ares. We'll do this in case maybe I get a new boon. And I do, look at that. Your flood shot becomes a pulse that damages foes around you. I don't think I even know what that is. Whoa. Okay, so that one must be one that I don't see very often because I rarely take Poseidon's cast. Not that I mind it, it's just I don't prioritize it. So if he's offering anything else, I'll skip the cast. But I guess it's good that I did that because uh, the cast I took on a lark from the first of those shop things ended up giving me the duo in the second one. So I'm very happy about that. That matters way more than just plus one level to a random one of my three boons. Again, you no, that's not a random one of my three boons. That is... Okay, that was dumb. I don't know what I'm doing, but I need to stop doing it, because it's dumb. <laughs> Alright, you know the guy who has got a spear, and uh, he swings it around him, doing a ton of damage? Yeah, why don't you just stand next to him for a while so that your cast can do some damage? Yeah, yeah, okay, that's actually not a good boon. <laughs> At least, oh god, at least not against Hades. We are going to let go of the dream of doing damage to Hades with my flood shot. We're just going to let it go. Oh, we have greater call already? Well, he did just have his invulnerability, so let's turn on the second invulnerability. Okay, we're going for quality over quantity. First he gave me one shield-o. Why did I just do that? That was kind of weird. Um, and then he gave me one of the chariots. I don't really want to deal with these ads. Okay, there it goes. Wow, that god gauge is charging rather rapidly. It must be said. Okay, this is good. A lot of free damage. Greater call? Yeah, we'll do the greater call. Um, this might take him down to halfway. It might not. Even if it does, I don't think it would be wasting that much. Yeah, it didn't even quite get him there. I definitely made the right choice. Don't know how I didn't get hit by that spear. There he goes. Yeah, that pulse thing is much better earlier in the run so you can use it against random or not random uh, regular enemies so we've got the, the special doing stacking damage we've got hangover happening faster we've got Boris taking damage for no reason and this will finish him off thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed it please like and or subscribe and I'll see you again soon take care or if you want to stick around for this let's stick around for it Ooh, that was quick. Almost got uh, got away from me there. Slippery trout. Blood of the Titans. The often dying prince, having achieved his purpose, then reflects upon his life and deeds, remembering his many past demises with such vivid clarity that this occurs. Okay, let's see. I'm still not going to give you nectar because it doesn't matter. Why, thank you. Your son. I know how mortals hate waiting around. Not everybody knows exactly how to give you pets and live to tell them, right, boy? Okay, Hades is a speech bubble. Maybe this is where he tells me it's okay for me to use my Chthonic companion in battle against him. Say, father, or do not do didn't you try? Nope. Can't wait. Excellent work. Mm, next. Oh, that's a big one. So this allows us to... Oh my goodness, I can't believe I had to cut while finishing this up. So basically we go here, 
and should be dispatched over to the house contractor now. We then have to pay some diamonds to the house contractor. It's three diamonds, a non-trivial number of diamonds. Luckily, I had 18. And this finishes your... Basically just finishes your quest with Orpheus and Eurydice. It reunites them. And that allows you to finish your quest with Achilles... And that gets you Achilles' Chthonic Companion. So, that's why it's important to do that. Achilles needs you to either free Orpheus, or reunite Orpheus with Eurydice, or free Sisyphus, before he'll be like, Oh, I saw that thing that you did with the other people. Maybe you could do the same thing with me. And you can then cancel his contract with uh, separating him from Patroclus. Okay. Can I do... Oh, hey, I can. I have exactly four Ambrosia. Perfect. So, we've given Dusa ten Ambrosia, but she will volunteer to give it back. Now, I think I might have been able to give Meg more... Uh, Ambrosia as well. What's for breakfast? Dinner, maybe? Five fish that time. Wow. Okay. Oh, a diamond? Cool. Um, I think I might have been able to give Meg Ambrosia, but that's fine. It's not urgent. She gave me her companion. That's the most important thing. And we have all the time in the world to finish, you know, whatever bonding needs to be finished. Okay. We can continue improving on Dark Foresight here. Ooh. 24 darkness short of the next one. And what's our next weapon? It is... Very well. It's the rail. Okay, for the rail... Uh, I think I'm gonna take Zeus. I think I'm gonna take... I'm gonna take Zeus just because I, I need Zeus to give me the damn code phrase for the hidden aspect. I have enough Titan blood invested in this, more than enough in fact, the minimum is five. We have unlocked this one that cost one and we've paid five here, which is seven. So we've got two more than we need, or one more than we need. Um, but yeah, he just hasn't said the line yet. So we'll be doing that for the heat. Okay, we can just keep on extreme measures one and two, turn off benefits package. We're not quite there with this weapon because I failed a time or two and that'll do it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and or subscribe. I'll see you again soon. Take care.